Hey guys! This isn't really a adventure vlog thing. So, we got back from Paris and it's been about two weeks since we've been back and I've been waiting so patiently to finally unbox these things that I got. And I know that they are like, they were really popular and then Instagram trends kind of changed. But I have been waiting and waiting and waiting until I got back and I was had time to film this. So today I am going to be unboxing. I got in Paris at Sephora. I got the rose petal blush that everyone was raving about a while ago. So I got that and I also got the matching brush and they gave me a really, really cute little free gift for the purchase and I haven't opened anything at all. It's just been sitting on my nightstand waiting for me. So I finally had time and I'm sitting down and doing this video. So all together, I think this cost me about 178 euros. So it was on the pricey side, but it was really worth it because it's something I've been waiting and waiting and waiting for. So. I opened the box and this box, the larger box, is just the container, the cute, really cute container that it comes in. So there's the, the top of the container. And there's the bottom. It has like really cute detailing on it. The first girl that I asked in Sephora if they had it she had absolutely no idea what I was talking about. She redirected me to another store down the road and I was like, no, I've watched a couple of YouTube videos and I happen to know that they got it at Sephora. So this is the second of the smaller box and this one has the rose petals in it. So it comes in like a really cute satin case and it has like a, like a pull tie, it has the brand on the front. And then here's the rose petals. This is hard to get out. Here's the rose petals. And I got it in the second shade, which is the medium pink shade. The first shade was a little bit too peachy for my skin tone, and the second shade was way too purple. So this was a shade that was right in the middle. So I'm gonna open it. It really it smells like a little bit of baby powder mixed with like like rose perfume but that's the roses so i'm gonna go ahead and just do i want to dump them in or lay them nicely i'm just gonna dump them in but here's what it looks like in the uh, bottom part of the container and with the with the top part on it's so cute I'm so excited to set this on my vanity and use it and everything. And I went ahead and just got the brush that came with it because I was getting everything else. Why not get the brush? I haven't felt it yet, but she tested it out on me in the store and the brush did kind of feel a little plasticky. It wasn't very soft. Oh, uh, see these ones are, these ones feel much nicer than the uh, tester brush that she used on me in the store. They're very, very soft. I'm not wearing any blush, so I am going to be trying the blush out, so I'm really excited. It is very heavily pigmented. So before I try it, I'm going to show you guys. The lady that helped me, she was super, super sweet. She told me, she said, if you're going to buy this, come back and see me, and I'll give you a free gift. So before I left Sephora, I just went up and I, I told her, thank you for helping me. And she gave me whatever's in here. It's so This is a, a cute little box that it came in. It's like a really cute, you know those like paper fans that open? It's one of those. It has like a little elastic around it. So that's what I got as like a free gift sort of thing. Really cute. It has a little chain that hangs down with the same sort of emblem that's on the front of the container. Oh, this is nice. It came with a really, like a little pouch for you to put it in. So I guess if you wanted to carry it in. So now, I'm going to be testing out the blush so that you guys can see what it looks like. And the brush also has the same emblem. It looks like, um, just like a woman. So, it's really cute and the brand name's on the back. So let's test it. 
I have my mirror right here. So I'm gonna be kind of dipping out of view and testing it. I don't know if you can see that, but I can, and it's like a really pretty. It's just kind of like a really nice, like rosy glow. The brush feels really, really soft. Really, 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 really soft. So I like that. But what I did, I decided just to swirl. So I just like swirled it in there a little bit, very lightly, and just applied it. I can't get over this smell. Um, I really like it. Some people might think that it's really not worth a hundred and seventy-five whatever dollars, but it's something that I really wanted for a long time, and this was my little souvenir gift to myself after going to Paris. I know that these are also available online, but I've looked into it before, and the site was a little bit confusing as they do not have an English translation option. So that was a little bit difficult, but if you can navigate the site or if you have a Sephora near you that sells them, they also come in smaller pots that I think are about half the price, but it's about half the product. This brand is mostly for the really cute look that they have, so I liked it. I treated myself, you know, I gotta do that every once in a while. Thank you guys for watching this, this really quick little unboxing slash review slash tester. Keep watching our channel. We try to put out videos on Tuesdays. Thank you guys for watching. Alright, bye guys.